Hey there, it's Stephen Pegg from Loves to Travel. Thanks for checking out our videos. We do appreciate it. As always, if you've not hit the subscribe button below, please do so. Also that bell notification button below. That way you'll get notified when we put up future videos. We're doing a, I, I want to call it a Disney trip, but we're not going to Disney. We're in Orlando, but we're not going into any of the parks. So it's kind of like a mini staycation at Disney. Um, and we're outside the parks. We've been inside the, we're outside the, uh, the Disney grounds though, the Disney bubble. We do have rooms on the Disney bubble that we've stayed at before this week, but we're outside the Disney bubble right now, staying at the Hilton Grand Vacation Tuscany, which is right next to the premier outlet malls in Orlando. And the reason we did this is because we can just walk across our own gate into the shopping mall and go shopping. So that's what we did today. We went shopping at the Disney outlet store which is what we really, really like to do. I get a lot of my best deals at the Disney outlet store. The last time we came here in July, it was closed because of the pandemic. It's open now, but you've got to sign up to get into a virtual queue to get in. Uh, if you remember in the past, we've done videos inside the Disney outlet store where it's just been so crowded, it's really hard to get around the Disney, the Disney outlet store. Well, now with the virtual queue, they're limiting the amount of people that are inside the store. They're telling you when you can come back and go in. And I don't think that there was more than 50 people in the store and there was no problem getting it all. And we found some great deals. And I want to go over some of those deals if I can that we got. And one of the coolest things that we got was something for our Disney room. We have a Disney room at home, which basically has Disney prints, Disney posters, and they've got prints for sale that um, were done by a guy by the name of David McKelly, uh, uh, McNelly, rather, uh, known as McBiff. Um, he does Disney prints. And I'm gonna hold this up just a little bit so you can see it better, and maybe even get a little closer on this one. Um, this is Minnie Mouse. Now, he does a lot of these prints, and he has a lot of them uh, that, for sale on the Disney grounds, but this one was actually on clearance. We got this for 20 bucks. 20 bucks for this. It's already matted, so all we gotta do is find a frame to put it in, and that'll go in our Disney room. This is just one of the few things that we bought there. We got a lot of clothes when we were there. Um, I got, I like Hawaiian shirts. I like the Disney Hawaiian shirts. And this one is really cool. This is a Disney World, Disney World Hawaiian shirt. Um, really cool. It's just got the Walt Disney World logo on it. And I got that for 15 bucks. Normally $49.95. I got this for the grandkids, Peg picked this up. It's a bib set. So we got this for uh, $8.99, normally $14.99. So that's for the grandkids. There's, there's two of them, so I can give one to each grandkid. So that'd be kind of cool. I've got one grandkid and one on the way. Peg likes beanies. So Peg got this beanie that she's going to wear at work just to kind of like go, hello, I'm here. It says best day ever on it. It's normally priced uh, at uh, $24.99, she got it for $7.99. So she likes beanies, so there she goes with that. Um, we got some more shirts. I got myself a couple of golf shirts. I like these shirts, I really do, and they're, they're, the, they're the wicking fa fabric, so you, when, you, when you sweat in it, it really, they're good golf shirts to wear. They, they got the wicking fabric. Um, this was normally priced at $59.99, I got it for 20 bucks. I got two of them. I got one uh, purple because Peg loves purple, and then I also also, also got this uh, this lime green one. Again, twenty bucks normally fifty nine ninety nine. So I got a couple of golf shirts. Um, Peg loves hoodies, especially these type of hoodies. She's got two or three of these different types of hoodies, and she loves these. So she got this one here, Walt Disney World uh, hoodie, and normally it would be priced at. Well, let me see if I can get it here. Normally it would be priced at $44.99. She got it for $14. And again, this is all at the Disney outlet store in the uh, Premier Outlets in Orlando. Uh, if you're wondering where it is, it's just off International Drive on Vineland. Is it Vineland? It's off of Vineland. Off of Vineland and International Drive. That's where it is in Orlando. Because there's another outlet mall on the north side of Orlando. This is a different one. Uh, Peg likes leggings. So does my, uh, my, uh, my daughter-in-law, but these are for Peg. Uh, $24.99 normally, she got them for eight bucks. So, and these are all Magic Kingdom themed. It's got the castle on it. It's got uh, some other designs on it, Space Mountain, so on and so forth. Um, I got myself a t-shirt. I love t-shirts to wear, especially on weekends. I love this design of this shirt. It's got the different, you know, 
uh, All Ears, Walt Disney World, Shucks, so on and so forth. I'll have Mickey sayings on it. And again, at the clearance price of $7.99, normally $24.99. So I saved uh, almost 20 bucks on that t-shirt. And then uh, what else? Oh, another t-shirt that I got. Peg loves purple, so I got this one just because of Peg. It's got Mickey on it. I love Mickey. And again, you got to say $7.99 for a shirt that normally would have cost you 25 bucks. So again, saving like 18 bucks on a shirt. And then Peg wanted sunglasses. So she found sunglasses, and I think we got three pair of them all together. Uh, and they were all on sale as well. Uh, so these were, these were each um, $5.99 each. And I, I can't remember what the original price was on these because uh, they, didn't ha they don't have them on the sunglasses. Uh, but she got three of them, uh, two for the kids, for the grandkids. These two right here, right there. Uh, it's got some sayings on the, uh, on the earpieces. And the same thing for this one here. Again, these are for the grandkids. And then a pair for which one of the kids wants to wear the aviators. For six bucks, you can't go wrong with that. So we spent, how much was the price total on the price tag that we spent there? 158.55 and what normally would have cost us probably, if I can add it all up, probably around 400 or 450 bucks if we'd have had to buy it retail. So we saved, I wanna say three, maybe $400 on this. Does it say how much we saved on there? It does not. But if you look, if you add up the what would have been the retail price and what we actually paid for it, we probably saved close to three, maybe 350 bucks on what we bought today at the Disney outlet store. Now, you remember when Peg told you about how to save money with the Disney gift cards, um, and we actually double dipped because we used our Best Buy and got cash back on that. Um, but we used the, dip, uh, the, the Disney gift cards to pay for all this, so we saved even more money by using our Disney gift cards that we bought at Sam's Club which we bought at a discount. So just ways you can buy Disney and save money. Um, yes, people have called us cheap before. I, I like to say frugal, but I like Disney stuff and I don't like to pay full retail price for it if I can help it. So um, that's what we got today. There's supposed to be a truck coming in tomorrow. One of the cast members there at the Disney outlet says they've got a new truck that comes in Wednesdays and Saturdays. Well, tomorrow's Wednesday. So we're gonna go over tomorrow and see what new stuff they have. They had a lot of Christmas stuff from 2019. They had a lot of Easter and a lot of St. Patrick's Day stuff from this year that they couldn't sell because of the pandemic. So there was a lot of that stuff there. But we're gonna go over tomorrow and see what new stuff they have. By the way, you know, I know I need a haircut. Um, trust me, I know that. We were gonna get it cut before, but I couldn't get into great clips to get it cut. I'm not gonna pay the 100 bucks to get it cut down here. I'll get it cut home but when you're 95 out and it's humid, my hair curls. Sorry about that. Um, I, I just wanted to share that with you so that uh, anybody says, I need a haircut, I know that, trust me. Thanks for watching our videos, we do appreciate it. Um, if you've not yet subscribed to our channel, please, please do so, the button's down below. Also the bell notification button below, that'll tell you when we put up future videos and we'd love for you to hit the like button. Thanks for watching.